and this is this is this morning's mood. <laughs> it's a bit cloudy and cool again, so we're all on deck in blankets. <laughs> Helen's cocooned herself. <laughs> We've had a good breakfast at Cabana's again, though. You up? I just I went over to the pool and walked in it because it's a shallow bit. And I'm in charge today. It's Megan's, yeah, it's Megan's day in charge today, so uh, I'm not quite sure if she's picked this, but um, yeah, we're currently on deck. There's Holly. So yeah, I think it's just time for a little bit of uh, chilling out on the deck for a little bit, watching a film on Funnel Vision maybe. It's all good. Well, it's always ice cream time on a, on a Disney cruise, isn't it? What flavour did you get, Meg? Mint and chocolate. What did you get, Hal? Um, mango and strawberry. Mango and, mango and strawberry. And Helen's got a hot chocolate. <laughs> she looked cold, so I got her a hot chocolate. And then I them kiddos. Yeah? Something a bit ironic about being sat on a cold deck wrapped in a blanket but still eating an ice cream. Well, this really is the life. Coffee on deck, watching Cars 2. Kids, kids enjoying a nice hot chocolate. Even an overcast day, a bit chilly. It's not going to spoil it. Still plenty to do. That's a, be that's a good thing about a Disney cruise, is even if the weather's a bit rubbish, there's so much on board that you can actually do to keep yourself entertained. And it, it doesn't feel like you're scrambling around trying to find something either. Um, so we're going to go into the lobby and see um, if any of the characters are out. Yeah. What characters do we think are out? Have we had a look? Um, I, th I think I Stitch might have gone. Um, Let's have a look. Uh, characters. For today. Yeah, Daisy's out now. Then Minnie Mouse at 12. Then Goofy and Matt. Then Pluto. And then Mickey and his friends group photo. Mickey and friends group photo at two. Princess Jasmine at quarter past three. Pluto at 3.45. Rapunzel at four o'clock. So we could go and see Daisy, Daisy Duck. And possibly Minnie Mouse, and then we'd, but we'd have to go straight in for lunch at that point. And you, oh yeah, you've still got your, are you going, you, so you're going to put them in a scrapbook? Yeah. I think you should. All right, what else have we got on? Um, I show you my we're thing. also doing this family game show where you get to, you need to guess what, um, people about each other. Like you need to guess how, um, like. So the yes, actual like, one there in it, family, family time game show. show it. Can I show you my flying? It's thing? about how well do you know your family? Well enough to put it um, to the test in front of your fellow cruisers. Our family time game show is a perfect event for families to learn what they didn't know. And they didn't know about each other. Mm -hmm. So you get to know a so little doing, bit more about. We're people. doing that at half past one, mm -hmm. and then before that, we're just going to try and have meet a character, and then maybe go for some uh, some lunch. Yeah, even though we just had breakfast. <clears throat> I know I'm not hungry for lunch, <laughs> but that's just what you do on a cruise. You eat when when you want. Going on to meet Daisy now. It started raining on deck, so we decided to come in and uh, take shelter inside and meet a few characters instead. So girls, have we got mummy a little treat for all the hard work into the planning? Now? We'll go and take it to her now. You, Maggie's got it. So you can both give it to her. This way, this way. This way. Whoop! It's all right. That was good timing, wasn't it?
Nice. Oh my god, if I have a we're up, the star gazing. Ooh. Sorry, Holly will sit on the floor. You're alright on the floor. Just, just, on just, just go under there, we'll, we'll pass you food. <laughs> oh, thank you. Thanks very much. They'll tell you. Like you were with, um, no, 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 just tell her what it's for. It's for planning um, and all your hard work that goes into it and all the extra work you do. And it's the 25th No, it's the 50th. Oh my god, how did you find a 50th one? Did you just have it? No, a dolphin brought it. <laughs> do you not hear me calling it from the balcony this morning? <laughs> No, hear me do it <laughs> at, the, at the balcony. He's <laughs> into the dolphins. Swam all the way back to Miami, picked it up, and delivered it. And then a turtle climbed on board via a pelican. <laughs> and you like to see now a little mermaid? Yeah, it was just like Little Mermaid. It was a cross between Little Mermaid and Nemo. Thank you. Don't thank me, it's them. We did not pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> Been to my account. <laughs> no. Oh, so just, you, just to say thank you. There's loads of work and effort goes into the trips, and you're the chief organizer, so. <clears throat> oh, we've come back down to D Lounge. The scene of the bingo for another uh, family family game of some sort. Forget what it's billed at, billed as. But this is D Lounge. Lots of the family type of go on here. How's your Mickey bar that you got for free earlier? Yeah. Right place, right time to get them, weren't we? Holly, how's yours? Be nice. I'm not knowing. Can I try a little bit? Yeah, nice. This time being so. My name is Rebecca and I'm your co-host for this event. And with that, it's my pleasure to introduce your host for today. It is Mauricio. My co-host, Rebecca, everyone. Thank you. Now, welcome to Family Time Game Show. As the name implies, this is a family game show. So I want to be needing some contestants up here on the stage. But before we go crazy, let me tell you what I'm looking for. I'm looking for four families who are not afraid to, you know, like, spill the tea or maybe do some dirty laundry over here on the stage who are not going to be shy of the microphone who are ready to have some fun and i'm looking for a grown-up and a younger one so grab the person you want to come up here with and now it's your time to go crazy rebecca what you have with me right now? so tell me if you could have any superpower which one would it be and why um invisibility invisibility and mom I can't really tell. One wrote invisibility! Yay! It's a match! But so why invisibility? Um, to hide from people. <laughs> if you're safe, if you're feeling safe, just for three times. The question is, which of the seven dwarfs is your child most like when getting up in the morning? And the options are, is it A, happy, dog, Bashful, sleepy, sneezy, dopey, or grumpy. And then last but not least, tell me, Ella, um, which one of the dwarves do you resemble the most in the morning? Grumpy, you're like, you, you absolutely went for that one. Grumpy, no questions asked. Okay, let's see what mom had to say. And grumpy, it's a match. Good job. Stopping for refreshments at Vista Cafe. Oh, I'm digging a video at the entrance. I've got a cold coffee. Glass of wine and a selection of cakes. And you're sitting in the window doing your diary. Interestingly, the drink the drinks you have to pay for, but the cakes are free. So took advantage. So yeah, so we're heading back to the room, get the popcorn buckets, and we're gonna hit up the cinema, aren't we? I think we're gonna go via the pool deck though and get some snacks. Some chicken tenders, some fries, some snacky snacks. So we've got some drinks. And those guys are going to get some food. 
<coughs> snacks for the uh, cinema. And this is what a wet day on deck looks like. Films are still going. Still a few brave souls out there in the pool. I've seen a few guys going down the slide. It's probably the best time to do the slide, really. It'd be quiet, but yeah, it is officially bouncing down in the middle of the Atlantic today. So, a few brave souls, like I say, in the pool down there. But uh, yeah, not us. We're, we're staying nicely indoors today. It's getting quite busy in here for uh, the film, Guardians of the Galaxy 3. It's a newish film and it's raining, so I'd expect it as much. Hello, are you, are you being part of the family? Yeah. What, do you think of, what do you think of Guardians? Violent, funny and, and very sad. Yeah. We laughed, we cried. I only like it. It was an emotional rollercoaster. It was a little bit, wasn't it? It was a little bit, to be I fair. I only like the little animals. You all look beautiful. I only like the little animals. Don't I always? Um, it's dinner time, isn't it? Where are we tonight? In Chanty Garden. Chanty Garden. I never knew the menu. Is that a Frozen theme menu tonight? Yeah, it is. It's right. still not actually not it's supposed to get out of the freezer. Yeah, it's not, they've not just put it Ships in the freezer. It's a rocking tonight. I oh, know, it's very, uh, whoop, very <laughs> backwards and forwards, isn't it? Oh look, look at us all in the mirror there. Hi, say hi. Hi. Isn't it three we need to go to? It's three and then we need to walk down another one. No, it's four it's and then you walk. No, yeah, yeah so it's on deck two. There it is. And the is still going to be this one. Seven. Well, Megan never passes up the opportunity for a photo shoot, so... No, you're the one who decided we're, uh, to go Well, here. I said we should all have a picture, and Megan went, can I have a solo? So, this is more Megan's photo shoot that we're allowed on, let's be honest. If I'm in charge today, I just have one. I suppose, I suppose. So we're up next. Oh, absolutely loves it. Photo ops out tonight. We actually have like a little gallery here where you can actually buy some of these pictures that are on display. All off stream, 495. Disney Magic. One called Disney All Aboard for 375. Disney What's this Mickey one? $200 for Mickey. Well, there's a nice fleet of uh, Mickey's Mickey's magical fleet up 495. Castle yeah, 495 dollars. Yeah. Painting. That's easy to tell. That's what painted it. That's quite a cool mini one, isn't yeah. it? Oh, what about Captain Pirate? Uh, Captain, sorry, Pirate Mickey. That's 595. How much is that one at the bottom there? Wait, I'll. That's actually not too bad. It's a good one of Cruella. And I'm coming back to the room. I think we've got a frog. <laughs> Ribbit. Ribbit. Don't give Holly any more chocolate. She's hyper enough. I haven't had any chocolate. Yeah, she's not Shannon, but she had invisible chocolate. This is Holly during dinner. <laughs> Followed by frantic hyper Holly five minutes later when we're finishing his bedtime. I don't know. All right, this evening it is the highlight of the cruise. It is pirate night. Arr. So we're all dressed. Look at us, the pirate family. How was that said? Check. Okay, one up just arrived on the other side. Damn. No, don't worry. Oh yeah. What do we all look like? I'm Pearl the Pirate. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, we all got a bit sunburned today. We weren't very clever. I'm Pearl the Pirate. Come for pre, pre photo and dinner drinks at Bon Voyage. You're out there, girl. And then once the uh, photographers start filling up in there, we're going for some photos. 
got a couple of nice backdrops. Pirate themed backdrops, of course. So I'm assuming they'll be coming out soon. We'll go and enjoy that. More and more people making their way down already. Ollie, let's see your drink. What do you think? Is that nice? Meg, what do you think? Is it good? Well, it's not rum, but Easy. it'll do. Um, Alright, after a bit of a refreshment, we're going to go and try and get the queue for the meet and greet with Jack Sparrow. You looking forward to seeing Jack, girls? Yeah. Yeah, well, you've already met him, like me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not the same. I'm better, what are you on about? Say invitations a form of flattening and consider me that. <laughs> it's like I'm at the end of the world. <laughs> it's, not right. it's like looking in a broken mirror. <laughs> a broken mirror? Shall we get a portrait to you? Shall we? Yeah, pop on in there, matey. There you go. <laughs> Lovely, Thank dear. You very much. <laughs> sure, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Girls, what do you think of Jack? Is he alright? Is he good? Meg? He did not like him. What did you think of Jack? I think he was a bit intimidated by me myself, to be honest. I think he was a bit intimidated, yes. <laughs> Sparrow, I'm not going to lie, I think Jack Sparrow was a little bit intimidated by me today. I think he, uh, he recognised a true rival when he saw one. Um, you know, a rival in pirating schemes, a love rival maybe. If you could, si if you could see the look Helen just gave me. Um, <laughs> Hang on, Megan wants to show you a dance. Hang on, Megan, let me flip it around. Right, go on, you're on camera. Go on, you're on. Wow, I didn't realise there was a difference, to be honest. Right. Well, now I know. Now we're into the pool deck for fireworks and a little bit of a party, hopefully. Helen is officially starting proceedings tonight with a starter pistol. Take a deck this time. Ah, the Lord and Lady's a Where be my pirates?
concludes the pirate party and to conclude it the film on deck this evening is of course pirates of the caribbean it couldn't be anything but it really could it people getting the deck chairs out and blankets and sitting watching a bit of captain sparrow but we're going to get a drink in there back to the room i think everyone's a bit tired after that we do love pirate night and we're lucky we get a second one because it's a back-to-back -back cruise we uh we get to do another pirate night on the second leg, so more of it to come. It's officially my birthday. What better way to start birthday than a cabana's breakfast and then some characters? So at the minute, the characters are Goofy and Donald, but shortly they're going to change to Mickey and Pluto and it's Mickey and Pluto that we're in the queue for and then Ariel's out at one I think
Goofy and da Daisy or Donald? Is Daisy or Donald? Donald, Daisy, I'm not sure. Mickey and Pluto are out now. Yep. Holly. Cheers. Happy birthday to me. It's five o'clock somewhere, right? Ooh, that's good. Meeting Cinderella, of course. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you. We love looking for colorful pearls and clams. Did you get these out of a giant clam? No. <laughs> well, maybe you can come to Atlantica sometime and we can look for some. We've always been looking for pink ones, but we haven't had much luck yet. We heard pink and yellow are the rarest, so will you keep an eye out for some? Perfect. Maybe if we get enough, we can make a rainbow pearl necklace. What do you think? <laughs> yeah. Well, so why don't you take a picture? <laughs> Wonderful girls, you keep an eye out for those pearls, okay? Splash you later. Bye. Being serenaded while waiting for another group picture. Getting a nice big one this time, Mickey and friends on the stairs. There they come. Go and put this over here. come out on deck for a little bit. Helen was just about to strip off on the pool deck and get into a bikini. <laughs> and then realized that she was in fact fully dressed. Let's come up to deck, there's some dolphins apparently out here again. So we'll see if we can spot any. They little tiny dolphins down there, do we think? These ones? They might be. Oh, it looks like there's a wedding on board today.
do love the view from the back of the boat when you're just in the middle of nowhere. Oh, I've just been bought a happy birthday Disney cupcake here by my lovely family. Apparently there's two spoons in there, so I'm assuming I'm supposed to share it, but um, yeah, I don't think that'll happen. I think I'm going to enjoy this all to myself. That's lovely that, isn't it? Are you going to go in uh, Kids Club for a little bit, let me and Mummy go for a drink at uh, happy hour? Okay, you're going to play the Infinity game again. Right, go on. We'll see you in a bit. Right, we're off to Pink Champagne Bar. Yeah, we're going the wrong way, actually. The wrong way? Yeah. Why? Is it's it in the aft? Yeah. Well, we're, ooh, we're halfway between the two now, aren't we? Should we go to the middle and then and then down from there? Navigation fail. Yeah. Things have been a bit different with that Esther, yeah? You might have just been getting on tomorrow. <laughs> So the, oh, I don't know, it's hard to say, isn't it? <laughs> I know. Happy hour at pink. That's what we're here for. Oh, so pretty. Happy birthday to Alright, so after another amazing dinner. Amazing. The kids insisted. Yes. Insisted. I'm going to go back to Kids Club. So, um, well, I'll come down for another drink or two, eh? So we're back down here on deck four. Going back to the. Uh, oh, my God. Pink. Back to pink. Cocktail there. Uh, cocktail and Prosecco and Champagne Lounge. Alright, having finished in pink, we're now going to have a few drinks in the Skyline Lounge. Ooh. That's really nice. And on, on return to the to the room after a few beverages, our room host has done this for us. No, and, for you. Well, for us, how nice is that? And excuse the laundry, but uh, he's also done us An a towel elephant for the night with some chalky. I love how I love how he puts your uh, builder bear on the lights there. Doesn't look sinister at all. That. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that's cute. Have we all had a good day? Yeah. What's been your highlight? Um, Don't say the chocolate you've just had off the bed. Kids Club. Kids Club, awesome. You pay all that money for Disney Disney Cruise and the highlight is Kids Club. Oh, do you mean today on, out of the whole holiday? No, today. What's been your highlight today, kids? Kids Club. Kids Club, Holly? Do you, do you not know how much me and Megan enjoy Kids Club? Well, I, tell me. Is it really, really good? Very is it amazing? Yeah. yeah. Do you want to go tomorrow? Yeah. yeah. Right. Me and Megan said that me and Megan both want a day and all we want to do in the day is spend kids club all day. That sounds good to me. Are you happy with that? Yeah, because you want to go drink wine. Well, it gives us... No, not only wine, cocktails, beer. <laughs> uh, <laughs> but no, it, it get, I was going to say... Yeah, exactly. It gives, it gives us time to go and enjoy the adults only pool or maybe even the spa for a little bit. But so, Daddy, you need to pick us up for like, lunch. For lunch, yeah, we'll feed you. You know, that's bare essentials. Um, but no, if, genuinely, if you're up for it for a full day, you can have a full day there if you want. You up for it? Yeah. Should we say tomorrow? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Is it a date? Yeah, it's a date. It's a date. <laughs> All right. Let's see what tomorrow brings. So this morning we docked in uh, 
well basically Portugal Ponta Delgado I want to say I think it's called it's just a, a little island I think it is just off the coast of Portugal so this is our first first official stop first bit of land we've seen since we left Miami it's a gorgeous yacht down there next to our boat in fact I was right in front of our cabin that little that yacht down there it's a lovely day so far we've decided not to get off there's nothing here that we wanted to see and uh, we kind of want to take advantage of the ship potentially being a little bit quieter and it is so far I think we're the only ones around the pool we've come to the pool deck and we're the only ones here so far the forecast is looking a bit cloudy and rainy for this afternoon so we're going to make the most of the sun now and then uh, head in and do inside stuff a bit later on hopefully should be a lovely day so a few more people come down now, but it's still not exactly busy down here. Kids are having a good play. Finding Dory or whatever it's called is on the, the screen. That cloud's looking a bit ominous. It's gone for a bit of a walk around of the adults only deck. A little bit of time up here. Kids are at Kids Club. Down there. different kind of dinner tonight we've decided to come out skip the uh, rotational dining tonight and come out to the pool deck and get some pool food and watch a movie on the uh, on the screen tonight complete with blankets yeah the aqueducts going overhead there are we picks in blankets so yes yeah, so we thought we might sit here, out here for a little bit tonight and Chill and watch a film out here. There goes the aqueduct. How was your tea, girls? Your tea on deck? Yeah. Yeah, the pizza place opens back up in an hour, so I think we might get some pizza. And then I think the plan then is to go to Vanilla Peas and get some ice cream as well.
Doesn't it look really cool at night? I know. Well, let's walk up here. The shop smells so good. Get yeah, some sweets as well. That's yeah, that's fake. But that's what we were gonna have. We, yeah, we will get one at some point. Well, pick your ice cream first, then pick your toppings. That might be the better way of doing it. Daddy, why only two? Because like the ladies just said, they only, it only fits two on. But I want to have and then chocolate rocks, and Skittles, and then Oreo cookies. Some of these cakes look amazing as well. Three toppings. Okay, can I get the best thing on tomorrow? Yeah. Can't stop Hello. Oh, I like the 25th anniversary one. That looks cute. There's only one left. That's what I had the other day, wasn't it, for my birthday? Three more. They're amazing. <laughs> Show us what you got, kiddos. I got chocolate rocks and then they yeah, had look. for ages. And that had chocolate rocks for ages. We, yeah. love, we love chocolate rocks, don't we? No, we have. Yeah, we have. We've had them on a pudding at Animal Kingdom. Lodge. We've got another formal night tonight, so we've come down a bit early. All nice and ready to get some pictures. There's a special photo up here for the, with the, the rose. So we're going to get that. Oh! Holly's posing in the window. And there's another poser in the window. Hi. You are? Well, that's quite hot. Are we getting some more pickies, girls? Yeah? Are you not having a solo shoot, Meg? Alright, go on, Hall. You take the lead this time. Are you come and looking at some of the expensive jewelry, girl. Okay. Yeah. Found the nicest thing in the world. The thing in the world. Yeah. Which one? The Mickey bracelet. The Mickey. Is that the nicest thing in the world? Yeah. Do you think? What about the rings? What about the Mickey rings or the Mickey necklace? I don't wear the rings. That necklace there. That's six hundred thousand dollars. 
So we'll try it on Holly. Oh, on Holly. Do you realize how much this this costs? I'm gonna, I'm gonna this costs double our house. Oh my gosh, Holly is it's trying heavy. on a six hundred thousand dollar necklace. It's heavy. <laughs> It's oh my necklace. word. It's a very heavy necklace. I want to try it on. I want to try it That's on. amazing. It's very heavy. <gasps> it's a very heavy necklace. That's beautiful. Oh, At least you put it on the fastest runner. <laughs> <laughs> She's not the fastest swimmer though. That's <laughs> <laughs> the thing I'm about to do Megan. Oh, yeah. it is heavy. It is. Is it really heavy, Meg? Yeah. Oh, it's heavy. What do you think? So just bear in mind that costs more than two of our houses. <laughs> just just for reference, that piece of jewellery. Oh my god. Well, oh, we've just spied a character we're gonna go and uh, get in a queue for. There's Daisy! Girls, go and get go and catch her. Oh, this is where we're going to talk. Even better. Yes, what a sleigh. Right over here. Oh, yes, we're going to twirl, too. Holly, are you going to do a twirl? Oh, yeah. Fabulous. Come on, go and say hi. Good night. We stood right next to Cinderella. We stood right next to royalty and we didn't even know about it. three times but that's okay it's only three drinks down there I'm not missing anything don't worry in the main man now. Thank you, Mickey.
Are we doing the same? Oh, we've got a port day today, but we're not actually getting off the boat, so we've come up, bit of an overcast day, we've come up playing some sports, haven't we? Yeah. Go on, let's see you, Meg. Hey, first time. <laughs> There's Holly practicing her dribbling skills. Apparently they've learnt this in school recently, so this is officially school homework we're doing on, ho on holiday. That's my little justification for them not being in school. <laughs> right, full on, full on PE session here, teaching new skills and everything. I need a job, me, in a school. PE teacher. Well, that's true. Go on, show us what you got there, Meg. Show us if you can do it. Oh, under your leg. Nice. Holly? You, you've got an advantage, you can get your leg over your head. <laughs> Alright, heading into Skyline Lounge, we've got some mixology class. This is for us. He said, is anyone joining? Yeah, I was like... No, I'm, off, uh, I'm off for a bit. <laughs> Kids club, I just booked two legs. Feel free. Thank you. Ooh, fancy. You know, I can become a little bit boring, so there is always something behind me, right? It will change, the skyline will change every 15 minutes, you know, so there is always something to look at. Cover the shot with us. This is a so-called tequila slammer. So what you're going to do it, of course, you're going to slam it, right? Cover the shot with the same napkin, and whoever has a wooden table, do it on a wooden table. Glass table, uh, don't do it. Do it on the side of the chair, right? Two, three, four times, make it fizzy, and chug, 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 everybody. Oh, I'm gonna have to turn the camera around for this one. There we go. Half shot of tequila, the other half, anything sparkling you wanna put inside. Soda water, Sprite, Red Bull. In this case, my secret portion is tonic water with a little honey. A little mm. honey inside. Makes it smoother. Make it smoother, mm. makes it smoother, and very, very efficient, because once you drink something bubbly, something fizzy, those bubbles, they travel faster than any blood cell in your body and ends up straight here. <laughs> right? You feel it here, but they go here. So now I'm going to need first three victims, I mean volunteers, right? <laughs> who'd like to come to approach and to make the drinks for the rest of the class. It's fun, guys. That you're supposed to use when making a mojito is a muddler, but the one that has flat surface. Never use the one with the sharp edges because you're going to destroy everything inside. When you're making any mojito type drink, the mint goes always on the bottom. All, all the fruits and modifiers go on top. Basically, you're just squeezing the juice from the fruits. At the same time, you're pressing the mint and they will open up. What is the most important tool that you need in order to create any cocktail, especially a martini? Shaker. Shaker. Now, the edit mandatory ice. This cocktail or martini goes in a ratio three to one. So the, the larger number always goes to the base spirit. So you can fill up the mixing glass with three quarters of the curry. Three quarters of the glass. Just by eyeball. Huh? By eyeball. Yeah. 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 Just by yeah. eyeball, yeah. Right here yeah. Here. Yes. Maybe a little more. Okay. Three quarters. Yeah. Don't be shy. You're making Don't be shy. A little, more. A little bit more? <laughs> yeah, you are. That's good. A little more, a little more, a little more. The last quarter. Saint Germain. Saint Germain. This is the best one, the, 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 the best elderflower liqueur. Never go with these uh, cheap versions of the Kuiper, Marie Brizard, Bob, yeah. whatever they have, the metal tin, right? Goes on the top of the shaker and a little punch. Yeah, just a little, don't beat my shaker, right? <laughs> You're behaving. Now, flip the whole thing. Mixing glass always facing you. All, mixing glass always facing you. Now, right thumb. Right thumb goes on the bottom of the mixing glass, the rest of the fingers 
will grab both parts. Then start chasing, moving the eyes rigorously from one side to another and make a move. Face the audience, right? Keep it, keep it dance, Macarena. One, two, right? <laughs> <laughs> this is the question. How long are you supposed to shake? How do you know your drink is ready? Are we counting? I was going to say, my hands are freezing, that's how I know. My hands are freezing. That's the perfect thing, now you know. Once you can, cannot hold the shaker anymore, once you feel it's too cold, that's the, that's the perfect time, it's the glass. You should hear the sound ah, when it's yeah. open, when it's unlocked. Yeah? Yep. That's it, very good. <laughs> yeah, but it's training. So, you put it on top of the, the, of the metal team, and how are you going to hold it? You go yeah, like you want to grab somebody by the neck and then leave one finger on top. Right? Let me see if, if ah, everybody grabbed somebody before on the neck. Okay. <laughs> 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 you know how to do it, right? <laughs> and then strain slowly into the martini glasses in front of you. Yeah. yeah. I was always struggling how to explain people to leave one finger. Go grab him by the neck and leave one finger on top. And then, and then everybody at the front. It's kind of garnish. This one, this one goes with a garnish of a filthy cherry. Yeah. But uh, my, my glass is 12 ounces, so when I drop a cherry over there, I don't make too much damage. Yeah. Ooh la la is good? Mm. Mm. Ooh la la. Ooh la la. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh la la. Which is awfully sweet. Right? If you try to zip, you're gonna taste blue curacao, which is not that tasty because it's made out of skin of orange. It, it, it looks great like a presentation, but in order to get the full flavor from the drink, if you if you always when you get a long drink with different colors, you need to destroy them, you need to mix it up so you get the, the nice. before mixing it up, we call it a skylight. After mixing, don't call it at all. <laughs> Swamp, sewage, I don't know. Yeah, right. Deep nice. wash color. <laughs> Done good. But oh, it's, it's good. Thank, good. Thank, you. Thank you. Allow vodka to absorb all the flavor. It smells great. Right? It smells very fresh. <laughs> nice. Feel free to reuse your stirrer. Try to try to bring the fruits on top. And then extra, extra. Instantly become blue. Mm. Oh, the citron is nice, nice in that, isn't it? I thought you were going to like That was really nice. I didn't, ex didn't expect the, uh, I didn't expect the, the citrus flavour to be as strong, but it's nice, that. I love amaretto and I love Bailey's. This is going to be a win, this. Yeah, you're doing all right there, Peter. Not too bad. Good. Yeah, get in there, get in there. Only the first one is Three, two, one, let's go. Chug, let's chug, go. chug, 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 chug. Anything at once. Oh, that was a bit good. Uh, like an ice cream, right? That was very good. Uh, oh dear, I've got another one. <laughs> what a shame. <laughs> I'll do them at Christmas. Mm. That was yummy, right? A, a, a real dessert, right? We do like amaretto and we do like Bailey, so that was always going to be, especially with the squirt of cream on top as well. Yeah. After dinner tonight, a late night showing on the new Avatar <laughs> film. Can't persuade the kids to spend three hours in the cinema, so I'll come by myself. And um, my supplies. Let's go on in. Alrighty. So after that late night showing. Avatar, it's now 1.20 in the morning. Ship's practically empty apart from a few souls. I've come up on deck as we're passing through the Straits of Gibraltar right now and that land that we can see over there, I believe, I could be wrong, is Morocco. This is what the uh, deck area looks like. Lots of cleaning going on at one, one o'clock in the morning. Clearly on the graveyard shift. It's all little beautiful. One night we are going to ride the aqueduct at night. Yeah, and this is the other side. So I believe that must be that land. Uh, yeah, the other side of it just been at is Morocco. This must be like Gibraltar, basically in the bottom end of Spain. Yeah, so there you 
go. This is the ship at 1.15, 1.20 in the morning. I think it's uh, time to head down. Get some sleep. Down here at Evolution for Aladdin Trivia. Are we going to win this this time, kiddos? Pen and paper collected. Just got a Meg. Making our way down. Scribe. Hey, we did pretty well on that. We did pretty well on that one. 13 out of 15, and the winning team got 14. We're up there for a tie break, so we actually did pretty well. Well done, girls. Good knowledge. Good skills. Good knowledge. Do a lad in trivia. It's a bit of a lunch with the viewers. We set sail. Next destination, Barcelona. Thank you. 